and greetings everyone in this video we'll be looking at nca level 1 uh, mathematics common assessment task algebra and in this video i'll be looking at uh, exam type question on uh, solving exponential equations example here it says solve 3 to the power of x times uh, 9 to the power of x minus 1 is equal to 81 and in this case you can clearly see that we have got different bases so uh, step number one uh, what we need to do is uh, we need to rewrite as powers of a common base and uh, it's three in this case so we'll uh, use uh, factor three to quickly split 81 so 81 can be written as nine times nine and then we can split nine into three times three and likewise the other nine is three times three as well so once i've got that i now know that 81 is same as three to the power of four and also uh, i know that nine is uh, three squared so using this information so three times three is nine so three squared and uh, 81 is uh, three to the power of four as you can see here so what i will then need to do is uh, uh, insert brackets actually because i've got uh, more than one term here as a power so you've got to be careful so we need to contain this as one item so uh, brackets will uh, help achieve that so once I've inserted the brackets, then I will need to rewrite as powers of uh, common base. So this one's already base three. Uh, nine has to be written as three squared, as you can see here. And 81 will be rewritten as three to the power of four. So we'll uh, quickly do that. So three to the power of X times uh, three squared, as you can see, nine is three squared to the power of X minus one is equal to uh, three to the power of four, because 81 is now three to the power of four so once we've written uh, as um, common base of three then we will need to remove the bracket here so this gives us uh, three to the power of x times three to the power of uh, two into x minus one is equal to three to the power of four and then we remove the bracket here so three to the power of x times three to the power of two times x is two x and two times negative one is negative two is equal to 3 to the power of 4 so once i've removed the brackets then uh, we will need to simplify by using laws of indices in this case i've got uh, the bases are same here and we are multiplying and uh, if the base is same and we multiply the rule says we will add the powers so uh, this becomes x plus 2x which gives you 3x minus 2 is equal to 3 to the power of 4 remember base is same we add the powers uh, like uh, mentioned in this rule here so this simplifies to uh, 3 to the power of 3x take away 2 is equal to 3 to the power of 4 what this means is 3 to the power of uh, 3x minus 2 is same as 3 to the power of 4 and uh, what that means is uh, 3x minus 2 will be equal to 4 so we drop the bases so this gives us uh, 3x minus 2 which is equal to 4 and then uh, we solve for x so we'll move negative 2 on the other side so minus 2 will become plus 2 so 4 plus 2 becomes 6 so 3x is equal to 6 dividing uh, 3 on both sides gives you x value of 2 done so here's a quick summary so what you need to do first is rewrite the bases as powers of a common base and uh, then uh, you substitute the rewritten bases into the original equation once you've done that then uh, you simplify exponents if possible using uh, laws of indices and then you can solve for the uh, variable i uh, hope this makes sense i would suggest if you can uh, pause the video and uh, try this yourself thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video